Hey guys, we got a great video for you today. The best part being the ending and the instant karma that comes. There was no audio released with these videos, so let's listen in on the chief of police. During the late evening hours of Tuesday, October 24th, 2023, Cody conducted a traffic stop at, at the 1600 block of Toronto Road in Springfield. He approached the vehicle and began speaking with the driver identified as Cristobal Santana. At some point during the conversation, Santana exited his vehicle and fired at least 10 shots at Cody, some of which struck him at least two, one at each leg. Cody tried to take cover, but the suspect ran after him, catching up to him, and repeatedly struck him in the head and face with the gun after completely emptying the magazine. It's hard to tell here, but the officer falls down, the suspect chases him, and then begins beating the tar out of him. CPD has confirmed, and it's in other open sources, that uh, the individual that has been charged uh, by State's Attorney Wright uh, is also a person of interest in a homicide case in Chicago. That's right guys, he's the prime suspect in the murder of this girl right here. Cody suffered facial fractures, a skull fracture, and a brain bleed in addition to being struck multiple times by gunfire as I described. So as you can see the suspect takes off here, but what you also see is the officer begin to stand up, call for some help for himself, and then begin to stumble back to his patrol car. Police officers from multiple departments converged on the area in a matter of minutes to assist Cody and search for the suspect. ISP Division of Patrol officers, the ISP SWAT from the Division of Criminal Investigation and local SWAT teams were activated along with crisis response teams, drones and canines were also deployed. The ISP, we had our, our plane in the air and spotted the suspect running across the road helping officers on the ground close in and apprehend the suspect. Within three hours of this bloody attack on Cody, the suspect was taken into custody. By the grace of God, by his own endurance, and with the help of the public and first responders, Cody survived this brutal attack. Thankfully, there were many lights shining that night. Two good Samaritans who are here with me, Travis Rebbe and Lucas Wood, called for help and provided aid to Cody on scene. Well, he, he was apprehended and he was injured during the course of the apprehension. At ISP, we had our, our plane in the air and spotted the suspect running across the road, helping officers on the ground close in and apprehend the suspect. Sangamon County State's Attorney's Office filed formal charges against Cristobal Santana. The first count alleging attempted first degree murder with a 25 year to life firearm enhancement. Count two alleges attempted first degree murder of a peace officer. Count three alleges aggravated battery with a firearm. Count four alleges aggravated battery. And count five alleges the offense of aggravated unlawful use of a weapon. First thing I want to do is uh, provide an update on Trooper Dakota Chapman Green. He's still in the hospital and continues to improve each day. I was with him again this morning. He's, uh, he's in good spirits and uh, he looked a hell of a lot better than he did last week. Thank God. Hi, I'm Chris, Cody's mom. I want to thank everybody for coming here today and for all the support that he's been given. Um, you know the saying, God is good? No, he is great. Hello. It was tough. As a parent, this is your worst nightmare. I have to say, the love, camaraderie, and 
and family that we were brought into at the ISP. Is off the chart. Just a great bunch of guys, gals. Can't thank everybody enough for all the thoughts and prayers. We just want our boy to get better. He loves being a trooper. And he'll never quit being a trooper. <laughs> he has one speed. Let's go. I can't slow him down. <laughs> I've tried. But, uh, thanks to everybody. Oh, glad the officer is okay. Nobody deserves anything like that. The Illinois State Police has a fund that you can donate to for him. You'll see a link right here for that. We thank you for joining us today and watching this video. We have a lot of great videos to come, so stay tuned. If you like our content, we do have a gardening channel as well, so we hope you check that out. And hey, stay out of trouble.